In this tutorial, I will do a transient analysis of an RC network. I will apply a step voltage source like this as an input and I will find the output. So, well, first of all, this is step. So, you, I, as I have already told you, that I can synthesize this kind of a step source using PWL. So, the first step in this kind of synthesis is to give this a slope. So this is what I have given it here. So this coordinate is 0, 0, and I have given a small slope of 1 microsecond. I mean this duration is 1 microsecond from this point to the origin. So this becomes 0 0.001 m, 5. 5 is this level of voltage. And similarly this point, the last point is 1 m, 5. So this way I can represent this, P, this step as PWL L source approximation. And then the, this voltage source can be represented as connected between in and zero. And there is a resistor R1 between node in and out, and capacitor C1 between out and zero, and this value is one microsecond, micro farad. So let me show you how to represent uh, this in this space. So my Vs is between the input source is between zero and one in and zero, and it is basically three coordinate, one is here, other is here, other is here. So let me write PWL 0, 0, then 0 0.001 M comma 5 and then 2 M, that's my final coordinate is 1 M, 1 M comma 5. This is this point, last point is 1 in comma 5. So, this way I have represented this step source by PWL and the capacitor can be represented. Capacitor name of capacitor starts with letter R. So, I am calling it C1 and it is connected between node out and 0 and its value is 1 micro, 1 micro farad. So, 1 U, U for micro. Now, if I perform the transient analysis only up to 1m, you will see this change here. And then, because this waveform exists only for 1m, so that's why I am doing transient up to 1m. But I will tell you two more things later. So let's run this thing and press Ctrl A, press V out. My goodness, where is the resistance? Oh, there is a resistance. There is a resistor between in and out. Its value is 1k. File save run. Uh, so you can see, let me also plot input. Control A. So this is my VM, and capacitor is charging exponentially. It has not charged till 1 millisecond and the reason you can see that the capacitor usually takes 5 time constants so time constant is R into C which is 1 millisecond so 5 time constant means 5 milliseconds so it will charge only in 5 milliseconds so let's change this to 5 millisecond and see what happens ah well so you see that up to 5 millisecond this capacitor has almost fully charged right and uh, one more thing you might have noticed that although I define the PWL source only up to one millisecond, but beyond that it is also, uh, I mean even after one millisecond it's going. So whatever value you define here, that will remain constant till the time of simulation. So although I define it only for this, but it will this, this value will hold at this level up to the time of simulation, that is five millisecond. So this way I can simulate I can simulate a circuit containing capacitor and containing the steps. So thank you very much. More on time demon simulation in the next uh, tutorial.